welcome you may be trying to send large file through email to somebody maybe through gmail or outlook but you keep on getting notification that the file is too large example gmail accepts only 26.2 megabyte so in this video tutorial today i will guide you how you can get that soft okay so the solution we are going to take here is using one uh one drive okay so open your browser as you can see i've opened my edge browser then visit onedrive.com can see the website here okay as you're on onedrive you need to sign in but here i have already been signed in but if you don't use the product okay if you don't have account with onedrive just create an account on onedrive after that sign in and you'll be landed on the home page like this okay then the next step we have to take is to upload that large file you want to send to somebody through email okay upload it on this one drive so I'll click on upload select files so the file is already on my pc it can be pictures it can be videos but in this case we will be working with video so let's go with this video here which is 28.9 megabytes so i will upload it okay the file has been uploaded into my onedrive account you can see that here 28.9 megabytes so the next step i have to take is to send this this file to the person all right from here so i will check on it check the boss then look at the top parts of this interface select share okay in this session you have name group or email so type the email address of the person you want to send the file to you can see i have the email already typed here if they are more than one still type the email address of the second person here okay at this message session just you know type something there just to explain to him what the file is all about or what he needs to do with the file so i can say for the project so he knows all right so i don't need to start telling a lot of stories after that click on send button okay this file has now been sent to this recipient okay to this person so the person once he opens his email address we get this file in his email then he have to download it and then use it for what he wants to use it for so let's let me take you practically because this is still my email so i'll log into my email and then i'll see this file okay here am i in my inbox i can see you can see the file i just sent so all i need to do is to click on the mail for it to open once it opens I'll scroll down and then click on the open button okay this is the file here so click on download okay looking at the bottom part of this uh, screen you can see that this file has been downloaded okay so I believe you understood the steps you need to take first log into onedrive.com then upload the file on onedrive.com and then from there you send it to the email address of the person that needs the file it's as simple as that on the other hand if you're an android smartphone user and you want to send large file through email from your android device to someone's email there is an application which is a cloud storage application just like onedrive that is made available on many android devices okay so it is called google drive or simply put drive so search it upload a file on it and then you do what you want to do okay you send the file to the person and the person will get this so let me take you practically i swipe up through my phone and then i'll search for drive you can see the drive app i'll tap on it for it to open 
okay this is the home page of my google drive okay so what i will do is to upload the file i want to send to someone to this platform first so i will tap on the plus sign then select upload then i will navigate to my phone and then tap on the file i want to upload i'll go with my samsung then i save the name of the file or the folder contains the large file as youtube sample so i'll search for youtube sample okay okay see it here then it has opened so look at the large file the one i named large file so i'll tap on it okay the file is uploading gradually okay the file has been uploaded to my google drive okay which you can call drive as well so the next step i have to take right now is to send this file to someone it's a large file so i'm sending it to somebody i want to use it so i'll press and hold on the file for it to be selected then i will tap on the three dots at the top right i will select the option to share now under add people or group type the email address of the person you want to send this last file to Then after that, you can leave a message as message explaining what this file is all about. Please use this to work on the project. Okay, after you have typed a short message communicating the information what this is for, Tap on the arrow that points towards the that points towards the right at the top right. So that's all, and the file will be sent to the person. Once the person gets the email, he will then open it and then download it. Thank you for taking your time to watch through this video. I hope it helps. Please, if it has value, do well to hit the like button. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do so by clicking the subscribe button. Thank you and see you some other time.